What Katie's doing is laying three straight tracks. The first one's about 20 steps long and she's gonna put some food at about every five steps she'll put a treat. And then at the end she'll put a flag um, with and her glove with the food in the glove. And then she'll come over and 15 to 20 steps to her left she'll make another track only make it about uh, twice as long as this one doing the same thing. And then when she's done with that about 15 to 20 steps to the left of that track she will do that's another straight track that's about um, 60 steps long. So, and then she'll do these in order. <clears throat> she'll run these in order with her dog. And hopefully by the time she's got to the third one, the dog will have this down kind of a, as a pattern training method and will understand that they're supposed to be pulling towards the glove that has a jackpot of food in, the, in it at the end. That's fine. And see how she comes way around so she doesn't try to interfere or get her scent to interfere with her track that she just laid. Although I'm sure her dog will know this. I'm not recording my drunk walk. No, but I'm the one that's going to be hit, getting hit by a car if I'm standing out here in the middle of the road. Yeah. So how far down should I go? About 15, 20 steps. A little bit. That's probably good. Just step back and get it, you're fine. One thing you have to do when you're laying these straight tracks is pick a, an object on the horizon that you can walk straight towards so that your track is straight. There are a lot of trees and some poles and some power lines and, and towers and things like that on the other side that she can look at and pick. Again, she's going out past her other track.